Hello, everyone. <clears throat> I'm doing good. How are you? Hello. How's it going? <laughs> That's good. Okay. Mm. Uh, how was everyone's day? Anyone do anything exciting? Okay. Hello. Define exciting. <laughs> um, anything interesting? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm not really sure. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> All right. So, I still got no idea what I'm doing in here. What a... <laughs> Are you like fishing or something <laughs> evil? <laughs> There's only one way to be sure. What? What? Wait. Hang on. Did we already? I just ask that you don't disturb anything. The Chief West found out about what we're doing. All that progress, we lost it. Oh no, that means I'm going to have to go back through it again. Oh, no. It wasn't. I asked if you were on a fishing trip or something. I didn't. I didn't. Okay, so I, I do remember where we're at, though. This is right after the fire. We investigated it. We just have to go through everything again. That That's it. Like, we got to go through the rooms and the library and all that. Yeah. That's what we have to do. <sighs> okay. This door is locked. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Medicine! 
See, see. We just, we just have to do it all again. Uh, luckily, we didn't get much further than. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Um. Um. These bandages are covered in dried blood. But whose? Is it... No, it's this way. Okay. That's right. An original edition of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, dated 1818. Okay. So... When did you send it to me? <laughs> um, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I gotta redo the skill points. Ah. Wait, you have to throw the fish back? You don't get to keep it? Uh, I don't know. No, apparently not. I got it now. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, okay. Why do you call it the trash lake? Sport fishing? Huh. So why is it considered the trash lake? Like is there like a bunch of trash or you just don't like going there? Or? Mm, I gotta figure out where everything was. Hmm. Moby Dick, Melville's classic. The epic battle between man and whale. Mandatory reading for any whaler, I guess. <laughs> you know, I was going to say something. <laughs> but then I realized how stupid that was. I was going to say, isn't every fish the peaceful type? <laughs> but no, no, not every fish is the peaceful type. You got piranhas that are like... Animals. This place was falling apart long <laughs> before the fire. Huh. Well, I mean, you do live in a different country, right? So maybe they have different rules than us. <clears throat> Um, over here I do know, uh, a book on the first inhabitants there's of the actually, island. uh, certain Seems they got here areas that century. you actually can't keep fish. It's, it's the same here. 
But it just depends on where you go. The human body. Did I get this last time? A precise and very detailed truth of the human body compared to the animal world. Yeah, I think I got that last time. <clears throat> okay. I think I got everything here. Did I? Did I? Um, pretty sure. Dark water history. This place was settled back in 1692 by two families that seceded from the New England colonies. <laughs> but you didn't get to keep any of them? Book on hunting whales, the island's staple diet last century. Huh. Wow. something disturbing about this painting. Ah, uh, that's right. 20,000 leagues under the sea. Another story about the mysteries of the deep. Um. Oh, okay. Hey, look. I found a so far. That's new. Wow. Crowbar could prove useful. Uh, I ain't done that one. Greek mythology. Hecate, goddess of the dead, daughter of Tartarus, and mother of Scylla. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, so... Sarah have done to make this person threaten to call the police. Jesus, the mouse scared the shit out of me. Okay. Locked. The boys' room. <laughs> Uh, I don't mind. Um, there we go. 
I don't mind. Want to be good people? Like, they're not really. They just want to be. <laughs> Is that what you're trying to say? A child's fort. From what threat was Simon protecting his world? Uh... Well, I mean, there's a lot of people like that. Tom Sawyer. Mark Twain. Sarah must have read it to him before bed. Sleeping pills. Strong for an 11-year-old boy. What was wrong with this family? What nightmarish vision could have inspired them? Simon's troubles went beyond family problems. That kid saw something. Something terrified him. The argument that led oh. to their tragic end seems to have been simmering for some time. Okay, well we didn't read this. Okay. Simon's private journal. He seemed worried about his mother and her attacks. Tension also seems to be growing between the Hawkins couple. Could the fight been a result or fire been a result of the argument? Uh Saturday. Today with mother we played in the garden, but she is still sad. I hate it when she is sad. Is she angry with father? Sunday. Father scared me? Saddened me. I can't read that. He shouted loud and wanted to spank me, but mother did not want him to. He is always angry. Why? There are lots of strange things in his office. I just wanted to look at them. Tuesday. I built a castle for mother and me. <clears throat> I told her to come and hide with me. Wednesday. She's always painting monsters. I don't like her monsters. I have bad dreams and they come into my bedroom and look at me. I cry and mother shouts at me and father says I must take tablets. They are not nice. I don't want to take them. Tuesday. Mother is screaming again. She cries a lot. Father is sad too and angry with mother. I don't know why. She is erased. Wednesday, mother is sad again. At lunch, we ate in silence. It was strange. Father said, finish your dishes. We always eat the same thing. It looks like rotten fish and it smells very bad. Why does he always want us to eat that? It's not very nice. If we have to eat it again tonight, I will throw my plate on the floor and smash it. Yeah, that's probably the night. Um, uh, it was probably the night the fire happened because remember the plate was on the floor. What's your joke? Why? Oh my god. What kind of joke is that? <laughs> um...
What will her room reveal about her? Barbiturates. Sarah Hawkins must have been extremely agitated resorting to such a treatment. Paper laying on the floor. Oh no, it's part of the rug. Ah. So tired. Okay. Let's put the points in, shall we? <laughs> um, beach. To do to do. I don't remember which one I done. Was it? Anything else? I said no object. Maybe that one. Yeah. We'll go with this. Do do do. Oh wait. Okay, I Despite what happened, they seem to have loved each other. Wait, did we find this last time? I don't think we found that last time. This ledger lists all of the paintings Sarah Hawkins sold. It seems the last one was given for free to a Francis Sanders. I wonder why. Sarah Hawkins' agent was getting worried. Seems she wasn't. Yeah, I didn't find this either. Okay. You can relate. I'm not eating anything. I haven't even muted my mic. Okay, uh. My very dear Sarah, ever since you left to bury yourself away on that last island, your art has been attracting increasing numbers of collectors. I beg you to send me some new paintings, the last one so sober and strange, moving as no other paintings have been, are selling at a premium price. Your percentage of these most recent list sales is attached. Do not forget your friend who was the first to recognize your genius and display it for the world. Affectionately yours, Maximilian. Nah. Uh -huh. Oh, Jesus. I'm sure that's not how you say it, but whatever. That's how I'm gonna. Okay, I think that leads to the hallway. Was Sarah Hawkins interested in the occult? What was she trying to achieve? I don't think we've done that either. I don't think I actually investigated the circle. Bradley? Is that you?
Mm. Oh god, it's out for now. Okay. Uh, God. Is anyone there? Is that him? You stop. Run. Run. Oh, where did he go? Wait, where did he go? Wait, did he come in here? I don't know where he went. It's you. I heard running in this corridor. There's an intruder in the house. It was him. do something. I don't think I can get up these stairs. I don't know if I'll be able to get back in if I leave. I guess not. There's nothing in here. I figured there would be, but apparently not. Okay. I don't know. I figured there would be. Man, the oil goes down really quick in this lamp. Where am I gonna get 
Tomorrow. Can you burn? This place was falling apart long nope. before the fire. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, but I need a... I didn't hear the hello there unless it was whenever the music was like blasting in my ear. I don't, uh, see. Anywhere I can even get oil. Oh wow, it's so quiet. <laughs> I wonder why it's super quiet. Yeah, no, you must have played it whenever I was chasing the dude because this door was I didn't closed hear what, what? What door? This door? This door. Where did he go? Must have got out some way. No, no, he was here. I'm sure. Let's search this room. How's it going? <laughs> Who knows? How are you? Ah! Um, oh. They look like Celtic runes. Charles must have brought them back from one of his foreign trips. It looks like an old seaway map. Mm -hmm. Somebody had added coordinates to this old sea map. They made a journey. Mm. Do uh, do we get to go there? Oh, look. Okay, so little gold cans. Little gold cans. Oh, why are these letters here, and not with Sarah Hawkins' belongings? These letters have been opened, but visibly have left, uh, not left Charles Hawkins' office. They are tied together by a carefully knotted braid. Why did Hawkins intercept his wife, Mel? Good question. Why? Clearly, Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. Charles Hawkins and Captain Fitzroy are posing with a third man. They seem close. Mm. I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. Probably another friend know of Hawkins. How. It looks like a freehand map of dark water. Certain areas have been highlighted. I wonder why. Huh. The Scylla. It's the boat that was stranded at the entrance to the harbor. Didn't the captain have one in the... Oh, wait, there's a secret passage. Didn't the captain have one in the... His thing? This globe seems to have been part of some mechanism. Oh, man. Did anyone know what the coordinates are? Oh, I don't remember the coordinates. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Doesn't work. I'm as if the bookcase has been moved several yeah, times. Yeah, yeah, we got that. We got it. Hang on, wait. No, oh, wrong one. But there's like so many different ones. Wait. Hmm. This panel is movable. Cogwheels. They must be linked to an opening mechanism. Probably a secret passage. Well, we already know that. We must find that. a way to activate the opening mechanism. Uh. Uh. 
Um with this, I should be able to force the gears. I don't know why, because it's never really a day here. <gasps> you broke it. Wait, did you actually wait, wait. Did you did you break it? Oh Oh no, it's still there. Okay. Whew. Uh, let's see. What do we want to do? We want to talk to people. Yep. That's what we're going to do. Hello? Oh, I'm sorry. Have a good night. <laughs> um, sure, why not? I know I'm going to have to focus on one thing eventually, and I don't know what, though. Like... Well done, Pierce. Yay! I guess I don't have to, uh, figure out the globe. <laughs> or if I do, then... Oh, no, I guess not. Yay. Oh, uh, tunnels under the Hawkins Mansion. I should read this. I guess. I didn't realize I was that strong. Inside the Hawkins Mansion, the recent uh, scene of the fire revealed its secrets. Pierce and Officer Bradley, now uh, on the trail of the, a survivor, had undertaken the, uh, to search the place looking for proof when a hoard hooded man leapt into Sarah Hawkins' workshop to steal a painting. Detective and police officers set off after him. Uh, by following him to the office of Charles Hawkins, the discovery of a secret passage, Pierce and Bradley entered the tunnel under the mansion. <clears throat> secret passage under the manor. It's like a detective <laughs> novel. Mother Doc, Mother, Mother Doc. Mm, yeah. Okay. And Mother he had a Duck direct is also a man in scene. this game. We must find him. What is this place? More than just a tunnel. Wow, look at that. Look, someone's been here recently. What, you think? Three seats. Did Charles Hawkins use this place? Who were the others? What is this mask supposed to represent? Did Charles Hawkins hide something in this chest? Probably. Is that it? Usually there's like three. Am I missing something?
Does anyone see a magnifying glass? I mean, I don't. <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> No, like, really, though, like, I don't see anything else. Usually there's, like, three, though. Hmm. I don't know. I guess that's it. Yeah, but what? I mean, I don't see. We looked at the chest. We looked at the table. We looked at the mask. I guess that's it? I don't know. Nope, there has to be something else. It won't let me out of here. I can't leave! I can't leave this until I find the other thing, you guys. I'm stuck. I just go around pressing buttons until I come across it. It's got to be here somewhere. Right? Right. Okay. You? Is it you? <laughs> oh, no. uh, okay. Think. I don't see anything. <laughs> ah, okay. <sighs> no, it's <sighs> I don't see I don't see it like I don't I don't see the other thing I'm supposed to... Cloth is unmistakably from a dress. Sarah Hawkins. Was she hiding from someone? Whoever was sitting here could have seen Sarah Hawkins. Could this be related to her death? Mm, we got it.
Oh wait, did we not go back? This is the way we came, right? Yeah, okay. So... You know... That looks an awful lot like Cthulhu's face. <laughs> Just saying. This symbol. What does it mean? A series of studies on an unknown symbol. We don't know. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh. I think he wanted to know where I was. <laughs> Just think, if he wasn't here with me, I wouldn't have any witnesses. I guess I need the lantern. I'm gonna fall. Watch. Are you coming? I'm gonna fall straight down. Of course. And something tells me that the key is climbing these steps. There's tunnels all over this island. Given the size of this cave, there's got to be other entrances. The passage continues further down. Might as well start with that. Wait, so I ain't going to squeeze in there. I'll find another way. If possible, I prefer it's not to ruin down. my uniform. Fine, fine. Go look for another entrance. Oh my god, I'll try my you luck care so below. much about your uniform. Wait, are we going down? Is that what he said? Wait, are we going down? Ah, I guess so. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be in trouble. That's what this means. Oh, yuckies. Why are we in water? Do we gotta be in water? But wait! There was a crate. But there was a crate. Unacceptable condition! Okay. Unacceptable! I can't go back. Oh man. What the hell? I can't go back and there was a little box. Some kind of dream catcher. If I touch it, it'll turn to dust. Hmm. I used to make dream catchers when I was younger. <gasps> hey, can I go here? No. Stupid. These paintings must be several centuries old. Why they gotta be several centuries old? 
This monstrous creature must be an allegory. A what? These people lying down. Are they dead? Are they asleep? Yes. No. These buildings seem to have come out of the water. <gasps> it's Riley. Ray, Ray, Ray Lai. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> spooky, scary, spooky, scary. Oi. Oh, I thought that was treasure for a minute. Cute. Yeah, that's smart. Jump down in the cave. Oh, retard. Look, if he would have only waited like two fucking seconds, I could have let him in. But no. He had to go and walk away. What's this? Can we jump up? No, we can't. Maybe we can fall to our death, though. Time has weakened these structures. Oh, you think? They're wood. Of course they're going to weaken. Oh. Anything? Anything? No, no. <laughs> probably. He probably hides out of here and was like, I don't want any part of this. Jesus. But no. I don't have time to search them all. Really? Can I find out what's in it? Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. What the hell is this? It's glowing green. Is that acid? Or gas? Oh, it could be a gas. Oh, it good. looks like animal oil. Oil? So Wait, what? What kind of animal oil is green? Oh wait, hang on. I got my lighter. I don't know. Most of the lanterns, if you notice, like, inside the manor, like the mansion, whatever they call it, um, if, uh, if you notice, like, some of the lamps or whatever, they were green, too. <laughs> oh, it's funny. What's going on here? Beers. Keep your voice down. We're not alone. Oh god, the cop's gonna get shot, isn't he? What have you got me into? See? He's a wuss. He's a we'll cop. See. I'll go on. Try to go down on your side. 
Yeah, th there's a passage. I'll meet you at the bottom. Oh my god. He's gonna get killed. Then it's gonna be our fault. Are we gonna jump? What are we doing? Oh. Oh. Wait, hang on. Okay, so we gotta go this way. Dude, there's that painting again. Oh. A mass grave. A spinning tornado fire, right, because that's not going to go badly at all. Because there's hardly any sounds right now. Does that not look just like him? Oh, there's someone behind you. Look, they have Cthulhu face. <gasps> Are you a retard? <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. Uh, I, I, got, I, I got it. Oh, it can't breathe. Yeah, they should be What's louder now. Happening? What? We're like... Oh, Jesus. I don't... Uh, I don't like this. No, damn it! I must find a way out of here. Uh... I don't like this. When they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, when you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Uh, something about a mass grave. Uh, I don't know. He said something about it when we walked up to it. Is it... Is it my turn? Yes. 
It is time. You will soon be one of us. If your body and mind are ready. I dream of it every night. I have constant visions. I am ready. Good enough. Prove it to us. It's like in my Try dream. Try it again. He had a dream? I can't remember what his dream was. It seems to have been used recently. Probably some sort of ritual. I found this dagger in the tunnels under Hawkins Manor. Its owner left it behind when he went to the other of the other hooded men. I can't read Latin. Can I like borrow some of your like liquid? Yeah, oil. Oh wait, maybe I should try the door first. Right, I knew that. Uh, well, here, hang on. I think I can try one. I don't know how loud it's going to be, though. There we go. <laughs> Is that better? Is that louder? <laughs> okay. At least we got that take care of. I should add what? I should add more of what? If you go on my page, like on the little section thing, I have like a list of them there. There should be like a little uh, box thing that's there. Um, but I can only have... 30 I can only have 30 and for the channel ones like the dragon and the la 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 um, I can only have 5 of them oh 
Yeah, uh, I, I don't know, it's, um, I guess it's for, like, it beats me. Grant him your flesh and accept his, so that his body and yours may be one. Ibithnk, Hapadk, Kutulu, Bithnkor. Grant him your mind and accept his, so that his mind and yours may be one. Ye loig pad kutulu loig na. Grant him your dreams and accept his, so that the paths of your souls finally intertwine. Your el kutulu kashag. Let his soul guide you to us, just as your dreams. I feel him. Shh. You are gifted indeed. Not another word. Let him pass through every part of you. All you who sleep, we pray for your return into the kingdom of the earth. Bring me more sacred flesh. dead. This ritual killed him. Where's the sense in that? Well, yeah. <laughs> what does this writing mean? We are ready for the ceremony. What about your protege? His awakening is complete. He will join you shortly. Okay. Oh, Jesus.
Gesichter weiß Natuno. Lenaaf, Klee noch Schlagwelle. Gorkanirach, Sigoff, wenn ihr Wir in die Gesichter weiß Natuno. Lenaaf, Klee noch Schlagwelle. Gorkanirach. How many of you want to bet these are the town people? Like all of the town people. I saw two odd looking guys coming down. Seemed up to no good. What in the world is this? An intruder! Oh shit! Uh oh, speak Don't move! Police! Don't move! I'm in danger! <laughs> I, I won't hesitate, hesitate to get, get back! You. Get back! You asked for it! No, don't do it! Oh, disturbing. Charles, you shouldn't have seen this. Ah! No! So yeah, I told you he was going to die. Are we running? Are we running? Are we? Are we running? It's been caving in. I need to get out of here. Are we running? Are we gonna run? Run! Ah. Oh shit! I don't know where I'm going. Run, 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 run. I think I died. <laughs> ah, ah, my leg. Ah. You gotta keep going, dude. You're gonna die. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're Look, fine. Blood. You're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Just keep going, just keep going. What do you do? You go. Oh, oh. I don't know where I am or what I'm doing. Oh my gosh, you're so slow. Light. At last. Right, because, you know, you want to stay here and say, oh shit. Riverside Institute. <laughs> We're in a crazy home now. <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right. Uh, Pierce... An officer Bradley followed the intruder to the secret meeting place of the cult, set in a network of underground caves right under the Hawkins Manor. They witnessed a strange ceremony led by a Charles Hawkins, very much alive. Bradley tried to arrest him, but Hawkins, whose body displayed various mutations, disemboweled the uh, police officer. As he tried to escape him, Pierce found himself prisoner of a rock fell. Of a rock fell. Fall? Rock fall. Rush to the Riverside Institute. He is in a critical state. <laughs> you can go to bed if you want. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, we're gonna get mutated. Oh no. Survive. Strong, there, he's opening his eyes. 
The save been fuller. I I can't get up. Don't move, Pierce. You can certainly say that you gave us a scare. <laughs> what did you do to me? Undo these straps. Whoa. Didn't he go die? Easy, my friend. You were dead. He killed you. Are you sure he's better? He was he was dead. Me too. We we were dead. What are you doing? I'm sorry, my friend. <laughs> What? No! <gasps> yeah, I guess that makes sense. What happened to me? Where am I? Mr. Sanders, you have to come with us. No! <coughs> I can't leave here. You've got no choice, Sanders, and neither do we. You don't understand? If I go out there... No! No! You're leaving this cell! Please. I don't want him to find me. Well, I guess we can't do nothing. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Jesus. Oh, 
but the earth will resound to your cries or theirs. You there. Wake up. Come on, stand up. We don't have much time. Can you stand up? Who are you? A friend of Ethan Bradley. It was he who told me that you had been interned here. Wait. Bradley is really alive? I don't understand. You filled me... So full of drugs, I can't distinguish dream from reality. Please believe that I have nothing to do with these disgraceful treatments. Look, I don't have time to explain everything. I'm not really supposed to be here. And the same goes for you, according to Ethan. You must leave as soon as possible, and as unobtrusively as possible. I've brought you your clothes. Let me go ahead. We'll meet upstairs. Uh, wait a minute. Why should I trust you? I don't even know your name. All I have is a woman dressed as a doctor, which is not particularly reassuring. I am Dr. Marie Colden. I work in this institute. Mm. But that does not mean I approve Oi. of everything Dr. Fuller does. He hides a lot of things from me, especially on this floor. We must not stay here. There are two men standing guard near the stairs. It's the only way to the floor above. I shall try to distract them and get at least one to come with me. All you need to do is to follow me as soon as the way is free. Understood. What does this mean? What did they inject him with? Am I in an asylum? Sarah? Why the strange symbol repeated over and over? What did he write about the painting? Sarah Hawkins is on this list of authorized visitors. Weird. If I don't get out of here, I'll end up like him. Poor wretch. Surprised to see you, but we all know that your curiosity will be your ruin. I don't understand. These people need care. You keep them in this.
terrible place as if... Go back upstairs where your patients are waiting for you to treat them. As for you, <coughs> darling, do not disappoint me <coughs> any longer. No one enters um. and leaves. Yes, doctor. Damn it. I'll have to find a way of getting rid of those two myself. I didn't say about being red. How do we save the game? <gasps> oh, I don't think we can. Okay. Okay. So apparently he doesn't like closing spaces. Right out. The machine is working again, but the control wheels haven't been put back on. I was just going to the storage room. I can bring them to you. Oh no, that's not that's no, not right. Doctor Fuller doesn't want us touching the pressure valves. As you want. I'm gonna see if there are sleeping pills left. They run out again upstairs. Put a few aside for me, will you? And above all, leave the wheels where they are. Good God, what could this machine be used for? According to the records, the patient seems to be suffering some from psychosis. Uh, he gouged out his own eyes when it's back of delirium. Is there a connection between this corpse and the machine? I'm assuming so. The corpse is complete. Whose are these limbs? Well, who do you think? This machine seems to consume a great deal of electricity. What will happen if I increase the current to the limit? Well, I wonder... Vats of rotten flesh? An elaborate electrical system? Like a dumb pulp novel. Worse and worse. I can still increase the load. Okay. I can still increase the load. I don't understand, but okay. You. Yeah, you there. You there. I don't know what you're doing there, but you don't seem to be friends with the nurses. I can help you. Help me, and I'll owe you one. What do you want? Sleep. That's all. Sleep? You don't want to leave? No. Have you seen the storm that's brewing? I'm fine here, except for one problem. You want sleeping pills, right? Yeah. And in exchange, I can make noise. Lots of noise. 
You'll draw the guards to your cell to allow me to escape. So, you in? Find something to make me sleep, and I'll take care of the guards for you. I'll find you some pills. Go look in the storage room. There must be sleeping pills there. Wheel? I can't go that way. What? I'm so confused. Oh, you mean, uh, the dude yelling. Locked. Exactly what I need. It's locked. And that's it, Doc. Last week's incident caused significant damage to the infraction. Uh, putting a stop to current experiments. This is unacceptable. From now on, the wills to operate the gas stopcocks must be kept in storage room after each use. Moreover, you must keep the register of use up to date, Dr. Fuller. The green gas leaves from here and it runs through the whole building. This valve controls the pressure. Dr. Fuller, I repaired your machine as best I can. However, the piping has been damaged and I fear that gas is escaping. I cannot do any more in such short time. All I can do is warn you if the equipment is put under too much pressure, the risk of explosion. Oh. Okay. Are we going to explode this place? The duct. It's impossible to break this chain with my bare hands. The control wheel is missing. Mm, I need the wheel. So I need the will and a key. Perfect. It's an ammeter. I didn't expect to see one on this little rock. Have I activated anything? I don't know. Can you 
can you just... Oh. Control wheel is missing. I think we established he's scared of small spaces. I don't know why I didn't say infrastructures. Infrastructure? Wow. I can't read. No, I don't have a light. My light got lost. Perfect. Oh, shit. There. Hey. Uh -huh. I don't know. I just guess. <laughs> Uh, I guess it's storage room. Okay. So. I gotta. With these chains on your wrist, you can't escape.
Ashet. Process. I'm just trying to escape. This is so hard. <laughs> Where do they keep their sleeping bells? Scopolamine, morphine, opium. My new friend's sleeping pills. I've got what you want. Show me. No. There. And remember, they don't come for free. Don't you worry, you'll have your diversion. Go on now, go hide yourself. The crows, they're everywhere. Make them go away. Help.
What? What are you talking about? Use this control wheel to turn the valve I saw. I've got a I gotta be getting to the kitchen somehow. Yeah, I don't know. I don't do that. If they wear bras, I mean, some girls don't, so... Yeah, that would. Now for the next step. This lever must turn on the gas machine. I guess we still need one more. I don't know. Um, maybe they're not the brightest bulb in the box. not call me. He 
he does not call. Get me out. Don't let me sleep. What in is here. well enough inside me? I feel it in my head and in my body. He roars and swells and has strength of oceans. His waves rise. Master, he enters me. Yes, 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 yes. Mm. Go to bed. One, two, three, four, five. Six. No, 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 not, not six. Four, five. Just got a few days to go. Yeah, that's it. Four days a month. No more. Perhaps. I, 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 I think I got the right date. My calculations are always right. It's the date. It's the date that's the spread. That, that's, that's, that's the problem. I don't know what this date is, but the calculations, they're right. Four days, maximum. Kind of a bitch. Hey. <laughs> I saw something over there. What are you cussing at? This way. Oh, man. Right?
Zoology, esotericism, mineralogy, and a full shelf on cephalopods. <laughs> Sarah Hawkins. She was a patient here. was interned at Riverside for fits of insanity a while before her death. She wasn't at her first attempt with a fire at the mansion. Dementia? Self-inflicted wounds? A document attesting to the fact that Irene Sanders, wife of Francis Sanders, had her husband... Uh, Finds a madness. Hmm. But who's that? Anatomy, anthropology, nothing surprising. Jorga von Gaming 100. Oh, thank you. <laughs> it's done. Now for the others. Follow the cord. One, two, three, four, five. Six. What is welling up inside me? I feel it. In Carnage. Theoretically, I've only got one lever to push.
Yeah. Um. I figured it would probably be easier that way, especially if I'm not, like, looking at the screen whenever it happens. where I came from. <laughs> oh, there's a... I can still increase the load. Okay. Sorry. Uh, yeah, I think it. I think it's a. Uh, I. I don't know. <laughs> so okay, I thought that's what we had to do, but apparently not. So the green one goes out here. push this one. You'll find me. You can see me. Let's calm down, please. No, no, no! Pain is just information, dear Francis. Invaluable information for my research. Kill me! Kill me! What? If you don't kill me, he will. My poor friend, I fear your mind is lost forever. I have no idea what was going on there, but okay. So we found the green, the red.
This All one. the levers are activated. We didn't even get the one in the room. That should draw the attention of the guards. Oh yeah, hide. like that's what the fuck we wanted. Where the fuck am I going? Probably not the best place to hide. What? How do you know when I mute my mic? This way. That should draw the attention of the guards. I should hide. Oh god, Damn really? It. What's going on? Is there somebody gonna let Fuller know? You can bet he'll be with us. Is that you? Don't you worry about the doctor. Right now, I have plenty to keep him busy with this precious machine. Mm -hmm. It gives us time to get away. I'll undo you. Get away? Get away where? I, I can't go anywhere. It'll find me like it found me here. You're mistaken about the beast. Don't stay with me, or you'll end up the same way. You're Sanders, aren't you? I heard you from my cell. What did they do to you? What does Fuller want with you? The doctor? You think it's the doctor who scares me? The doctor wants to heal me. But he's the one who's crazy. He wants to restore my sight. He wants to give me back my eyes. And yet I told him that I didn't want him. I do not want to see it anymore. The real culprit is Sarah. Her and her accursed paintings. You're kidding me. You're talking about Sarah Hawkins. <laughs> the one and only. The legendary. There is no artist more enlightened or cursed than Sarah Hawkins. What can you tell me about the Hawkins? You... you should leave before it's too late. I inspected the scene of the fire, and something is not right. Do you think Charles Hawkins could have killed his wife and faked his own death? What? No, of course not. He would never have done such a thing. She was the sole purpose of his life. I don't understand. What's going on on this island? I'm... I'm so sorry. That we should never have met. What are you talking about? Destiny! It has trapped you! No, don't let it see you, or you won't be able to escape it. So don't look at it! That's how it finds you! <laughs> what finds Why me? Why are you awake? <laughs> Sarah Hawkins visitor! The Shambler! Sanders, pull yourself together. Without her, it's no longer possible to save me. What the hell? Oh God. I got 
I got it. This is insane. What killed him? It's the one who... <laughs> uh, it's the one that we... Uh, we gotta find out about... Uh, seriously. We got to find out about, um, damn <coughs> the gas. <laughs> oh, my head later. We need to move on. It's the one whose death we're inv investigating. No, I'm not. What? Oh, the guy's screaming. Why do you think I'm eating something? Pierce woke up in an asylum installed in the cellars of the Riverside Institute. He met Dr. Colden, a female friend of Bradley, who helped him escape, wandering through the corridors of the place where Dr. Fuller resigns supreme, reigns supreme. Pierce was able to talk to a man called Francis Sanders before dying in full view of the detectives. He accused Sarah Hawkins of being... His cause of torment. Pierce finally left the accused building, accompanied by Brandy and Colden, or Bradley and Colden. The companions in misfortune decide to use the Hawkins mansion as a hideout. What? Who goes there? That nightmare again. I need a drink. No, you don't. <gasps> Is it daylight? Oh my god. Okay, but you know what? I know it's a little bit early. Have a good day or night day you said lunch it's day okay have a good day 
Um, uh, Jesus. <laughs> I was thinking about it, but I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I I would say that I would play on, but my only thing with that... Oh, look, it's so cleaned. And it's actual daylight. Uh, my only thing with that is I don't know when the next saving point is, and I don't want to continue to do stuff. Until the next saving spot. thing is I gotta get up early in the and six. I don't think I ever really set a time. early <laughs> uh, but first I have to eat dinner and then go to bed and then wake up I probably only get about Four hours, maybe. Four hours of sleep. Yep, yep, yep. No. No, I said I have to eat first. You don't know how long it takes me to eat. Just early. Yep, yep, yep. Jesus. 
just early. I put it anyway. <sighs> Get off of what? I never told you what time I got off work. <laughs> it's in the afternoon. <laughs> okay, what time did I say? Close. Okay. But anyway, <laughs> it doesn't matter. So, okay, I'm going to go, but <laughs> we're going to raid someone. And yes, we are raiding someone. Because <laughs> guess why? It's already happening. Okay. Bye, and I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? Have fun. Stick around. Say hi. <laughs> Bye. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, hi. Thank you. Welcome.